Today marks 10 years since a devastating tornado outbreak tore through southern Indiana. Henryville was hit hardest. Hundreds of homes destroyed and one man was killed while trying to protect his wife. But students lived through the storm and as our Jenny Runovich reports, that's part of a legacy of community strength. You know, 10 years later, the stories of recovery and resilience here in Henryville are nothing short of remarkable, especially at the schools where hundreds of children survived what could have been a deadly disaster. What we know is, is we've got complete destruction. Who can forget these images? A school bus wedged into a restaurant from 200 mile an hour winds. A high school gym collapsed in a direct hit. But students and educators who lived through that EF4 tornado in 2012 say each year since is cause for celebration. They made it through weather's worst. It's my 10th birthday. It's um, the survivors of Henryville tornado, their 10th birthday. Um, as we are all blessed to get a chance to continue to live our lives. 1300 students and 130 staffers survived all because of a key decision that Friday afternoon to send the buses and get kids home. Former principal Troy Albert calls the bus drivers true heroes. I went on the PA and made an announcement that we were going to dismiss it this time that we needed the drivers to travel safe and get to a safe spot as the tornado is heading our way and it looks like it's going to come right at the school. It did twice. Two storm cells 10 minutes apart shredded the schools as 85 students and staff who remained inside huddled in concrete offices and bathrooms. The whole experience still emotional a decade later. I rewatched the video yesterday of the gym. When you see the doors kind of just flicker and then the next thing you know, the whole wall comes across. It does not feel like 10 years at all. Isaac was a seventh grader in 2012. Someone ran by the house and said the school's completely gone. We're like, oh gosh. He now teaches in the same building that crews worked to rebuild just months after the monster hit. The takeaways now include that dedication to recover. It gives you a sense of pride being from here. And a legacy of protecting kids. Albert's new school district in Salem now adding safe rooms because of what happened in Henryville, making sure when the next storm hits, students survive again.